I've always kind of wanted to build something more and give back to the fans that come out. It's really beautiful, and to have the fans be a part of this, I mean, that's what makes it so special. They've found a way to really reach people in a special way. I think all of us want to push the boundaries all the time. We've always had a bigger vision. Technology's now gotten to a place where we can execute a lot of these ideas. We start looking at like what's doable. Can we make this happen? Is this something that we can try? It's been a journey, put it that way. <laughs> In capturing this campaign, the same technology that was going to be used to power the installation should be used to capture the installation. It was a combination of sending people to various locations, a couple different countries, me jumping on a plane at midnight to get to New York by 6 a.m. to be filming by 10 a.m. Honestly, the best stuff gets made when there's urgency. Urgency is kind of the name of the game. Ooh, hey, Miss Lily, how's it going? I love that effect, by the way. Well, just seeing the content, we're moving through it, and we're getting that actual echo effect, yeah, 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 right? Yeah. To the name echoes, and when you feel like, oh, the content's also echoing through it, like that's definitely going to be really effective. Like, yeah, make yeah, sure it's yeah. mapped right, you yeah, need to make yeah, sure it's playing sure. back right, you need to make sure the, sure. the LED is we'll working today. correctly. Yeah. So that's all happening today and Dean. Today. Okay, great. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I actually see this go from the computer <laughs> to real life. One of the craziest things that I discovered the battery life on the Snapdragon powered PC is amazing. That was able to run for hours on end without charging was vital to executing echoes. The ideas are great, but the execution is more important. You need a battery backbone of technology to make it work. The goal was to take all these moments that will never happen again and share them with the world for all those people that couldn't be there. I realized that the only way we're gonna be able to meet our timelines was to bring our entire team out to the gorge. Seven people working around the clock on the Snapdragon powered PC, bringing this creative vision to life. When people see this installation, something that's like gonna take them out of their everyday experience. It's honestly something we haven't seen before. Trying to think, how can we make this experience unique, you know? Tech, at this scale, it's the glue that kind of holds all this together. I mean, for us, it's very important to make it really you, mm -hmm. for you guys, for your fans, to this experience, because this will never be recreated again. How did Snapdragon make it possible? Not only did they literally power us, they also powered us to move people emotionally. I think when people walk through this for the first time, there's no doubt that the impossible becoming possible will be going through their minds. As I sat on the grass watching people experience echoes, just seeing what we did with tech and sound and visual, we had echoes playing voicemails left by fans to Odessa. You see the fans reacting to that, and you see how they're feeling the emotion. It made me think, like, what has this inspired them to do? From creating the installation to filming to editing, echoes was truly powered by Snapdragon. This is a cool new way to do it, which we haven't ever done before. Looking at renders on a computer to this finally coming to life, it really does make you think the impossible is really possible.